thought our guys competed very hard. I thought both teams did. I thought both teams really competed. But we know going into this series that that was going to be the case every game that we play. Uh, we did a few things uh, very well. I'm, I'm proud of the effort on the offensive on glass, uh, not allowing them many of them five. And our turnovers were low. Um, we just got to make some shots. I believe in our guys. Uh, they work. They work extremely hard every day to make those shots. And like I said. Um, those are good shots. We hope we hopeful that we're we are hopeful that we get those same shots next game. Uh, Lee Smithford appreciated the blue. Uh, can you talk a little bit about uh, the decision to play Kevin so many minutes, and then uh, the defensive matchup that he found himself up against uh, Marcus so Well, the decision playing Kevin Kevin a lot of minutes is that he's a pretty good player. <laughs> um, you know, he had he had plenty of rest, a lot of time off, uh, so that that wasn't a factor. His energy was good. He down, he passed, he made some shots. Uh, he got to the free throw line. You know, we, we didn't make shots tonight. And we didn't get to the free throw line other than KD. We got to somehow get to the free throw line. We've always been a good free throw shooting team. We didn't, we didn't make enough percentage we like, but we didn't get there as much as we accustomed to getting there. Ron, you mentioned Phil Memphis. It seemed like in the third quarter, the fourth, we got a little bit tempo. I mean, they weren't getting second chance points and the rebound like you want. It's like we're getting through a game like you said, but the shots just wouldn't drop. It had to feel like the tempo was more to lock in. No, it was it was everything was good other than we couldn't find uh, we couldn't make it make a basket. You know, we got 80, 80, 88 shot attempts. And we got pretty good luck. We missed a couple of I mean easy, easy, easy. And I wish we could get those same shots. Um, but to give them credit, they made plays down the stretch. Um, and, 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 you know, that's, that's playoff basketball. I mean, like I said, we put ourselves uh, all three games to be in the game and win the game at the end. We won one, lost two. We've got to uh, strap it up again come uh, Monday and, and, and compete the way we, we competed the last uh, three games. Nick Gallo for the NBA.com. Coach, I just wanted to get your thoughts on the defense as a whole, but specifically the surge defending Zach Randolph more than the eight points locked in. Well, I have a lot of respect for Zach, what he does and what he brings to this team. He's, he's a relentless player. He's uh, physical. He's, he has just a knack for scoring, and, and he's a hard guard to, for anybody to sleep. I thought Serge has done a, a good job on him uh, tonight. I don't know how many offensive rebounds. He had one offensive rebound, and, and, and that's, that's, that's quite an accomplishment considering we made them miss you know, 44 shots. Harry Trammell, Bill Bowman, you've got, to, you've got to find some points for someone. Serge getting a lot of shots, not making them. What, what's going on with him? I mean, he even he missed two dunks tonight. Yeah, he, you know, he missed a couple layups and a couple of dunks. It's something that he has to continue to fight through. We're going we're gonna to stay with him. We're going we're gonna to work through some of, the, some of the offense where he gets these same good looks, and he's going to have to step up and make them. And, and he, he, one thing about Serge, he, he works. He, he believes in in the, in the work that he does, and our guys believe in him. Otherwise, he's not going to get 17 shots. Uh, but they, they believe that he can make those shots and give give our guys a lot of credit. They're not going to uh, turn their back on a guy that, that hasn't made shots. And, but we we know he can, and he he will eventually. Hopefully, next game he does. Uh, Jerry, I'm at Henry Radio for Nashville. Coach, speak to the Reggie, Reggie Jackson's two plays in the fourth quarter with the, the charge we had Fisher going on the right side, went for a three, possibly took that charge and the foul on Mike Collin in the backcourt. Speak to that as a young player, or was that just a little, he was playing a little over aggressive on those two plays? Well, he's, he, he, had, he had a, a, a great game. You know? Unfortunately, he made, he made that, was a, that was a mistake that he wish he could get back, that we all do. But that, that one play did not, you know, did not decide the game. You know? Just the play before he had the big steal that put us in the position. To cut it to two, I, I thought, you know, that was a decision we could have got better, could have got a better look with. But it's not, I'm not going to say this had nothing. To, that play had nothing to do with win, winning and losing tonight. You know, we, we we put ourselves in this position with not shooting the ball well because we competed on the defensive end. And that's how we. That's how we've always won. That's how our DNA has made us. Is defensive toughness put ourselves in a position, and eventually we're going to have a stretch during the game when we get hot. We didn't have that tonight, and. Normally we do. We normally have three of them. Uh, Scott, Bob, Barry, Campbell, Oklahoma City. I think the last game, Fisher hit a three, and then he didn't score a point in the last 241 tonight, a three to tie it, no points in the last two minutes. So 
Is that just missed shots, or is that just failing to execute completely down the stretch? No, no, no. It, it was missed shots. You know, we had K KD had a, had a great move, he spun. They lost the ball. Tony Allen was aggressive, lost the ball, and he took the shot. We just saw it contested, and we had a chance to get the offensive rebound. We didn't do that. But there was a couple of possessions down the stretch where we had good looks, but we didn't. We didn't. We came up empty, but that's that's part of it. Um, you know, the score was in the 80s. We took a lot of shots, and we missed a lot of shots. Fourth quarter defense was good, a lot better than uh, let's say the last quarter. Coach Mark Kaplan, 730 Yahoo Sports. You talked about Kevin Durant not being fatigued, but he only had two points in the fourth quarter. What was that? Was that defense? Was he just not aggressive? Was well, he's one, one of the things with KD, he's a, he's a playmaker. He gave a lot of guys good shots, and he's going to continue to play that way. He's not, he's not a ball hog. He's not a gunner. He's a, he's a player, and he's going to look to make the right plays. And a lot of times, I don't know if you guys realize this, that he, he demands a lot of attention, so he has two or three guys on him. He can take, he can take as many shots as he, as he wants, but, but they're not going to be good shots when you have two or three guys covering him. And I give him, but that's it's all, he, he's always been that way. He looks for his teammates, and if we continue to do that, he's going to. Uh, they continue to do that. He's going to continue to not have a lot of points in the fourth quarter, but he's giving opportunities for other guys to make shots, and he believes in him. I believe in him. He believes in him. And that's what good teams do. Unfortunately, we didn't hit shots tonight. Coach, uh, what, what type of an effect do you think Tony Allen's defense has had on, on KD? You know, on no, he's an aggressive player. So that's one of the things that he does well. He's an aggressive player. Um, he's still, KD's going to get his points. I mean, he's not going to be, he's not gonna, no one stops him. So he, he, he has skill set that's hard to defend. And they do a good job of making them um, catch the ball tougher. But you know, I, I think KD he, he he had the game, he had the game that we wanted him to have. He rebounded, he passed, he didn't have high turnovers. He got to the free throw line, he missed them. You know, he's not a he missed, he's a 90% free throw shooter. But you know, I, I can't. I mean, they're going to continue to guard him that way. And our guys are going to continue to get good looks, and they're going to make them. Thanks, coach. Thanks, guys. See you guys. Bye.